Hello everyone, welcome to Gunpoint. This is a stealth puzzle game. I could explain it some more, but I think I'll just show you, because it'll be pretty clear exactly how everything works. Uh, I originally played the demo for this, and it was really fun, and now here's the full version of the game. That's about all I can think of to say, so let's just get into it. Well, that looked like it hurt. Oh, it seems she's calling me. Did you just get thrown out of a plate glass window? No. I work at the gun company across the road. Someone just got thrown out of your apartment window. I don't want to talk about it. I was actually about to call you about something else, but now I'm more interested in this. Well, try to move on. What did you need? My name's Selena Delgado. My boss, Rook, says you're some kind of freelance spy. I might have a job for you. Want to come up? Sure, buzz me in. Okay, and here we go. Yeah, even in the demo, I thought that... Everything seemed kind of too small in the game. And that definitely seems true here. I'm so small. I guess you kind of need all this area to really get... a a good view of the environment, but man, everything is really small. But anyway, yeah, I, I didn't fall or get pushed out of my apartment. In fact, I actually jumped because of my new pants. I think it's because of the pants. Uh, yeah, you don't, um... Like, pressing space does nothing. At least does nothing at the moment. You don't have a normal jump. What you do have is some sort of, like, weird supercharged thing that you charge up with the mouse button. Whee! So that's why I went flying. And you can climb up on stuff. And later on you'll get uh, you'll get to rewire some stuff, which is really cool. I only just got into that. That was kind of like I, I barely got to mess with it before the end of the demo, but it seems really cool. So anyway, this is just like the setup for the story, so let's keep going. This goes up. And Oh shit! My would-be employer just got murdered! Well, the camera saw me. Well, she's dead. Hundred and six seconds earlier. <laughs> Congratulations on purchasing your new Bullfrog brand hyper trousers. Caution, a maximum strength jump may shatter glass ceilings, windows, and children. Outdoor use only. Hmm. <laughs> Should have been more careful. Gunpoint. All right. Well, I'm going to be reading her um her dialogue, so I guess I should do it in like a kind of high-pitched voice. Try to sound like female. Okay. Let me attempt this. <clears throat> Conway, this is Melanie Rook. Selena Delgado worked for me. Do you have time to talk? Oh, wait a minute. I think I did the reverse of what I was supposed to do. Whoops. Um... Sure. I know you didn't kill Selena. I just watched the footage. Uh, the footage you walked right in front of a security camera on your way to Selena's office after the shots were fired. But the, e the East Point police won't look beyond an easy conviction. That footage puts you at the scene, and I have to turn it over to them. <laughs> Option number two, I agree that I am boned. Uh, why do you care? Selena was a friend. I want her real killer caught. In fact, I want him dead. But once he's in a jail cell, that becomes simpler to achieve. I have to hand that footage over if I have it, but uh, let's make sure I don't have it. I've wiped my copy, but my camera feeds get backed up to data centers in five different off-site locations. 
And if you can wipe them all, you're in the clear and the police will have to find the real killer. That actually sounds fairly wise. Head to the DataSec facility at Port Heath. I'll make sure the front door is open, but you'll have to take it from there. Okay. End call. All right, so this is the mission selection screen. Yep. Rook caught on camera. The footage of the uh, of you at the murder scene has been automatically backed up to five different locations. This is the closest. Get in there and wipe the data. I have no money, so I cannot buy any upgrades. Uh, oh, no, no, I can't buy any things. I can get an upgrade because I have one upgrade point, I guess. So I'd increase the speed and the distance traveled with the jump, or I can make the charge-up time better. Uh, let's make the jump faster and longer. All right, let's do this mission. On the top floor of this building, there's a bank of servers that, uh, with a computer nearby. If you can get to that, you can wipe the evidence that you were at our offices when Selena was killed. All right, how do I get in? I've had one of our tech guys open the front door for you. Their electrical systems are hackable from here, but for obvious reasons, their servers aren't. All right, how do I wipe the data? I've seen your record. This will be well within your abilities. Once you're in the scrubbers, uh, once you're in the scrubber script I'm sending, you will auto wipe anything with today's date ending in .mp4. All right, cool. Got it. Start mission. All right, so there's some tutorial stuff here, but I think I remember it from the demo that I played. I don't know, maybe a month ago or something. So yeah, you can charge it up, and you can also aim it. So you can do a little jump if you want. Or a big one. I keep wanting to press space to jump, but you can't. Alright. So I need to get in. The door's on the other side, so let's go up. Thankfully there appear to be no guards within, so that's not going to be an issue. Oh, I think there's bonuses you can get too, like this little laptop here. Yeah, this is an optional objective, a laptop with private data you can steal. All right, let's do that. All right, so you get like little bits of text and stuff. From Julian Mayfield, Chief of Police, to East Point Police Department all. Subject, private security. I've heard grumbling lately from some officers about your private security assignments. Since we merged with the city's largest security firm, the East Point Police Department now serves both roles. You might not like working for a corporation, but your job is the same. Protect and serve. With the endless budget cuts we've been through, the new funding from this merger is the only reason you even have halfway adequate equipment. Basically, tough. Mayfield. I think I can... How do I use the doors? Is it click? No. I forgot how you use stuff. Maybe you can't yet. I know you can close and open doors and stuff. Oh, there we go. Light switch. That clack noise of the light switch being turned is really satisfying. Alright, let's get rid of this incriminating evidence. Done. Main, main objective complete. Head to the subway on the right when you're ready. Okay, well, I could be an extremely messy uh, a thief and <laughs> break the window to escape, or I could just go down through the elevator and, yeah, not leave evidence that I did anything wrong. Which is what I'm going to do, because you get ratings for your performance after the mission. Let's go out of this mission with style. Here we go. Alright, client rating A+. I took a while to do it, but no violence, no witnesses, no noise. One upgrade point. Good job. Walking through already open doors is my specialty. <clears throat> Our feeds are backed up to four more facilities. The others are slightly better guarded, but nothing too taxing. I'll give you the addresses in order of security, since frankly, I have no idea how good you are. Thanks for giving my personal crisis a difficulty curve. Anytime. You'll see a mission briefing for a job on Proudmore Drive. Take it. 
Alright, the second backup from the camera that caught you at the murder scene is on Proudmoor Drive. Get in, wipe the data, get out. Alright, so now I have some money and an upgrade point. Let's also put that into distance, yeah. Okay, what can I buy? Alright, at the moment I can buy nothing. I have 30 bucks and the cheapest thing is 80. So, let's do it. The Busfield facility has better security. My guy can open the front door for you, but the door to the server room is secure. Two guards working tonight. Uh, whoever's in the server room can probably open the door to it. So get them to do it for you. Isn't that kind of the opposite of a guard job's description? It is, but these guys spend more time dealing with electrical faults than professional spies. It shouldn't be too hard to outwit them. Alright, guards will shoot on sight. The cursor turns red in areas guards can see. Jump on a guard to pin him to the ground. Okay, so I can use this to see the guard's line of sight. Okay, looks like it's a cone going up like this. Cone of vision. Alright, the security guard is turned away from me, so I suppose I can just enter in and pounce on him. Here we go. Okay, and then I think if I remember right from the demo, if you jump off, they're just going to be fine, right? You can punch the shit out of them and just beat them into oblivion, which is really disturbing, by the way. I tried it once, never again. Ugh. But if basically, if you want to do the least violent way of taking out a guard, I think you just punch them once. And then that's it. Okay, yeah, now they're out. Yeah, you can punch them infinitely, and it's really disturbing. Because the punching noises are very good. Alright, where's the extra laptop? Oh, there it is. Yeah, you can barely see it. It's like a group of six pixels down in the corner. So tiny. Okay. Let's go down. Right, so the guard can see in here, but he can't see through the door. So... What did I do here? Only guards can... Uh, only guards can use the red hand scanners. In the dark, guards will look for a light switch... Guards can't see very far in the dark. Okay, so I need to turn off the light to distract him and have him come out and turn it back on. If you turn out a light, they'll come and turn it back on. Uh, let me get this laptop first. From Julian Mayfield, Chief of Police, to East Point Police Department, all. Subject, swapping weapons. Getting sick of saying this, so I'll keep it brief. All police issue firearms are palm print coded to their owner. If you take or borrow someone else's gun, it will not fire. We're seeing far too many snafus like Friday. Perp's getting away because an officer is using a barred weapon or one stolen from evidence. If you lose your sidearm, which, which seems to happen more than I can fully comprehend, just report it. I'm waiving the fee for replacement. You need a gun that works. Mayfield. In other words, that's the game telling me that that's the reason you can't shoot people, because the gun won't work if you try to take it. Which is fine. I, I don't want this game to be about shooting. Okay. So, how do you do this? I need to... I need to turn off the light, he's going to come through here, but before he goes through the door, I need to latch on to here, and then pounce on him. Okay. There we go. And got him. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, I fell a little short and I just got shot point blank in the head. Ow. Uh, let's, load the, let's load the autosave four seconds ago. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's get this stuff. Oh, is it? It's done? Okay, done. You pounced on, but didn't kill. Ooh. So if you don't kill them, they count as a witness, which is bad, but oh well, it's fine. At least I'm not going to get any lethality. So witness, low violence, no noise, took a long time, but still, A+. Plus. Cool. To get into Ella Street facility, you'll need to rewire the building's electronics. If you don't have a crosslink, buy one. Okay, so now this is where the whole crosslink rewiring of stuff uh, part of the game gets uh, gets in here. And it's really cool. I only got a taste of it in the demo, so I'm not sure how deep it goes, but it just it seemed really cool. Alright, now I've got it. Let's put a point into speed of charging up. 
And let's go. I can't open the server room on Ellis Street, and there are no guards working tonight. You'll have to do it yourself. How? Any building wired in the last 20 years puts everything on a single power grid. The way things are connected is all handled in software, and software can be hacked. If, you, if you've got a cross-link, you can see all the connections and drag them around to work however you want. Make a light switch, open a door, or whatever. That doesn't seem like a great security feature. It's not. Anyone who's actually expecting a hacker puts all of their important stuff on an isolated circuit. The data here is a backup of a backup of a backup. There are more worried about hard drive failures than spies. What actually is a crosslink? <laughs> it's just a mod for your phone that lets you hack into a building's electronics and rewire stuff. Some security geek put it into closed beta and only people, uh, the only people using it are espionage operatives and asshole kids. Got it. All right, let's go. All right, switch to crosslink mode with the mouse or uh, mouse wheel or alt. Okay. All right, so it's got a little tutorial. Uh, click and drag a line from any device to link it to any other. Uh, so if you link a s from the switch to the door, the switch can open the door. Direction matters. Linking them the other way around won't do anything. All right, so right now the switch contain uh, the switch affects the light, turns it on and off. Instead, let's have it control the door. Done. Simple as that. All right, let's grab this laptop. From Julian Mayfield, Chief of Police, to East Point Police Department, all subject... blank. We're getting more and more reports of the electronics in these post-millennial buildings behaving strangely. Lights going out, but also more serious stuff like electronically locked doors suddenly swinging open. If you see anything like that, put it in your report and play it safe. Those doors open way too fast. Wait a minute. And play it safe. Those doors open way too fast. Does that mean if I open a door when a guard is coming towards it, I can knock them out? Ooh. Okay. I don't even remember doing that from the demo. I must have missed that. Hmm. Let me actually turn down the music volume. It's a little bit too high. Twenty? Alright, that's good. All right, let's go up. There are no guards here. Now this light switch will affect the door. Bingo. And done. Well, let's just close this up. Rewire it back to how it was before. See, nothing's wrong. Nothing at all. Alright, A+. Plus. Nothing except I took a long time, as always. I'm not going to speed run through the game, so... Yeah, I'm not going to go super fast. The next terminal's on Loxley Close. By the way, be careful with power sockets. They'll emit a shock if you cross-link something to them. Okay, so don't cross-link something to a power socket. Got it. Let's put another in distance. And let's go. Okay, now we have some guards to deal with. And we have quite a few things we can do. Okay, this power socket will activate nothing. So, wait a minute. I, they made a shock, right? Does that mean it's going to shock the person right in front of it? Ooh, I think it's time to do some experimenting. Also, I like how the music switches when you switch between the cross-link mode and out of it. Alright, he's looking the other way. I could easily pounce on him. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's try the... If you cross-link anything to them, they'll explode or something, right? So let's try that. Oh, I guess I need to use it. I need to use the switch, don't I? Okay. Oh, whoa. What the? 
I just double cross linked. Uh, can I like undo it? Uh oh. I'm not sure what I just did. Uh, but anyway, let's pounce on this guard. Okay. That's dealt with. Now, where's the laptop? There's gotta be a laptop somewhere here. Isn't there one in every level? Maybe not? Where is it? Laptop, laptop. I don't, I don't think there is one in here. No. Alright, so let's try this. Oh, wait, no, that's not a normal switch. Uh, this... This is a switch. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, God. Alright, turn it off. Turn it off. Oh, God. Stop. Stop. That's annoying. Okay. Knocks out nearby guards. Okay, so he's knocked out, not dead. Good, because I don't want to be lethal. Okay. Well, I've made a total mess of the wiring, but it got the job done. Hmm. Alright, how do I go up? Uh, here we go. Can you imagine trying to rewire this place after I fucked with it? They're gonna go into the building and they're gonna, like, flip the light switch and it's gonna turn on the blender. Or flush the toilet or something. It's gonna be a total mess. Ah, right, yeah, it doesn't seem to be a laptop in here. So, here we go. Whoops. Oh, need to open this. Yep, low violence, medium witnesses. Pretty damn good. Last one and you're clear. The data sec place on Gershwin and 4th is the biggest and most heavily guarded. But after this, there'll be no evidence linking you to Selena's murder. Okay. Uh, 130 now, can't buy anything yet. Okay, it's upgrade. Uh, let's upgrade speed and distance again, yeah. Alright, let's go. This is the last facility with a copy of the footage, but it's stored on three different servers. You'll need to get to three different terminals and hack each one. Ooh. Are you seeing anyone about your backup addiction? Well, you never know when a suspected murderer is going to try systematically erasing them. You do if you hired them. Good luck. <laughs> okay. I think this is where... Yeah, I think this is where the, um... The demo ended, I think. Wait, no, no, I did actually do this mission. Okay, I think it was the mission after this where the demo ended. Okay, so yeah, it's already getting a lot more complicated. There's a ton of things you could do. Are there any power sockets? Yes, one. Alright, one power socket. Alright, there's a camera. And there's a guard looking this way. I could go up here, but he'll see me. I can't go in here because I can't open the door, so the only way to go at the moment is through here. Also, where's the laptop? There's gotta be a laptop. Somewhere here. Oh, there it is. Right there. Alright, let's go up here. All right, let's take him out one at a time. Well, I can just go up and knock this guard out. Let's do that. Let's take care of one. Uh, hopefully I don't push him through the glass. I don't want to break it. God damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck, I killed him. Ah, uh, no. Hold on, kill me. Kill me. I want to reload. I don't want to kill him. Didn't know it would push him through the glass, although I suspected it would. Uh, let's just restart. Okay. That didn't work how I thought it would. Hmm. I could open this door, but then he'll see me. 
Okay. Light switch will activate a light. Okay, hold on. What if I... Oh yeah, I can turn off this light. The guard will come to turn it back on, and then I can use the power socket on it. Let's do that. <laughs> nice. Okay. That takes out one, although unfortunately it's in an area where I can't do anything. Now, how do I get you without killing you? How can I distract him? If I turn off the light, he's simply going to use this switch. But wait a minute. What if this switch doesn't actually activate the light? Will he still use it? What if I just wire it to, like, that? And wire this to that? What is he going to do? <laughs> It didn't work. All right, now come on back. Yeah. Wait a minute, is that guard gonna see me? Shit. Oh fuck, he can see me. No, if I jump down, he's gonna see me. Oh shit. Wait, he can see me even in the dark? No, no, I don't think he can. Like, I'm in his line of sight, but I, he shouldn't be able to see me through the dark. Alright, I'm going to pounce on this guard next time he comes. Wait till he's far away. Okay, yeah, he doesn't see me. Oh, shit. Better get him before he finds it. You saw something. There we go. <laughs> And there is everyone except the guy on the ground floor. Sweet. Alright, we'll attack this one. Done. Let's get the one down here. Yeah, guards cannot see you when you're hidden in the elevator. So unless you come out of the elevator, you are invisible. So if you're just like this, if you're just sitting here, you'll be fine. But if you come out, then they can see you. Alright. So. Uh, would he notice if I took out the camera? Let me try that. Nope, he does not notice. I could just get out of the elevator right behind him. I kind of want to do something more complicated, though. I want to try the door trick. But how would that work? I don't know how that'd work. Maybe... Hold on. Activate that. Set this to activate... I don't know, uh... That? Sure. Doesn't really matter. Maybe he'll go back and forth and investigate? And then I can try to hook this switch to the door. Let me try it. Oh yeah, come over here. Come over here. I'm going to close it. And then, and then... <laughs> Achievement, open door policy. Oh my god, that is awesome. This game is so cool. Shock guards, punch guards, hit them in the face with the door. Ah... <laughs> <sighs> All right, bonus item from Julian Mayfield, Chief of Police, to East Point Police Department. All subject cameras don't hate black people. What? <laughs> we need to put to rest this idiotic rumor about our security software detecting dark-skinned people as intruders. They don't. What they do is analyze the subject face, stature, and movement characteristics and match them against our database of known security personnel. That means if anyone who isn't police or private security walks in front of the camera, regardless of skin color, it will trigger. If it's connected to an alarm, that'll set it off. If not, it just adds a note to the footage for security to review later. 
Whether they're connected to anything or not, all our cameras also store feeds. So if you, for example, pull an African-American transient in off the street into a secure facility and shove him in front of a security camera in a misguided attempt to prove that a piece of software is racist, we have footage of you doing that. Oh, what? I, I feel like I'm missing something. Is that a reference to something that happened in the real world? I, I think it is. Like, I vaguely remember something about that. But, anyway. And done. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. This game is really satisfying. Meaty witnesses, low violence, no noise, and of course, thoughtful again, but A+. Well, I think that concludes our business. There's no nothing left that links you to Selena's murder, so the East Point police are going to have to look a little harder. If you don't find him, I, I will, and if they do... No, oh, if they don't find him, I will, and if they do, I'll know exactly where he is. Uh, then what? I have a medical degree and a gun company. He's going to find out why that makes it a bad idea to kill someone I like. <laughs> okay. So, who's my next employer going to be? Because I appear to be in the clear, so what next? Oh yeah, this, this is about where the demo ended. Like, I don't think I could start this new case. So I guess I start taking, like, freelance stuff at this point? Cullen's innocent. Hi, sorry to bother you guys. I don't know if this is the right place to post this, but I've just been arrested for murder, and I don't really know anyone, so I used my one call to post this. Hope you can help. Katie. Requires wire jack. Okay, I guess... Yes, I can just afford it. Rewires secure circuits. All right. I don't know how that works, but we're about to find out. Let's... Jump more quickly. All right, accept the mission. Pays pretty damn well, 300. Hi, thanks so much for applying. <laughs> for this money, even lowercase eyes couldn't keep me away. Sorry, my typing's not great. I borrowed this phone from a phone from a sex worker and I haven't figured out how to do capitals on it yet. My name's Katie Collins. I work at Rook, the gun company, and my friend Selena was killed last night. Someone's saying they saw me here, saw me there, and all the security footage has been deleted. Oh. Has it? Um. Sorry. That might have been my doing. Wow, that's kind of a dick move by somebody. <laughs> yeah, who would do that? <laughs> I know. I wasn't there at all last night, but I live alone, so I can't prove it without the footage. What can I do? The person saying they saw me there is Melanie Rooker's husband, Jackson. I don't want to get anyone in trouble, but maybe you could stop by his building and just see what's going on? Uh, what exactly do you need? He'll probably be in his office on the top floor. If you can get close enough to hear what he's saying, maybe you could listen in for a clue or something? And then throw him in some acid? Please, no acid. I just want to know what's going on. Okay. I won't take the acid just for you. Got it. Thank you so much. I hate to be a pain, but I really want to get out of here. It's scary. Let's go. Alright, so I bought the... What is it? The rewire secure circuits? How does that work? Is this any different? I mean, it looks different, but is it functionally any different? Whoa. The heck is that? How come when I mouse over this, everything lights up? At this point, I could use some sort of a tutorial. Hmm. Alright, well, first I need to get in. Obviously, I can't go up here because of the camera, so let's go up. Alright, so I just need to get close enough to here. So I need to get here. I need to get right to his door to see if I can find any clues. Need to eavesdrop. 
Well, let's climb around. Whee! Oh. I thought I was going to fall. Locked door opens if anything activates it. Wait, so how do I get in? Wait a minute, how do I get in? There's a camera there, and it's locked, and this door's locked, so wait, how do I... I feel like there should have been a tutorial thing for the new secure thing I just bought, and it didn't show up for some reason. Is there any, like, help? Nope. Alright, well, let's do... Can I wire? No, wait, I can't wire anything. What the... What is going on? I can't seem to wire anything. I did buy the crosslink thing, didn't I? R right? I can't really check my stuff, but it wouldn't have allowed me to take it if I couldn't, so what am I missing? I can't wire a single thing. Oh, wait a minute, I can wire this? Oh. So when it detects me, it'll open the door? Uh, okay. I don't really want to be seen by the camera, but I guess I have no choice. Alright. No, I can only open that one door. Oh, shit. Okay, here we go. Get to the green circuit box and use it. You'll be able to rewire things on the green circuit. Devices on different colored circuits can't be linked to each other. Okay, got it. Alright, so the red one is the one you can access anywhere by default. It's like the unsecured circuit. And I actually have to hack in to the secured circuit to be able to do stuff on it. Got it. Okay. Well, there's no one downstairs, so I might as well just go. Alright, where's the laptop? There's the laptop, for some reason just sitting on the ground in the server room. So now it's usable? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. Why does this person have rockets on display? That's kind of weird. It seems like that should belong in a museum, not someone's home. I hope they've been disarmed, or whatever you call it when you make an explodey thing not be explodable. Safety eyesed? Insafified? I don't know what you call that. D danger wrist? <laughs> I don't know. Alright, let's open this. Motion wait a minute. Motion detector triggers when anyone walks through it. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, I don't want to link to that because the door is already open. So, link it to... Can I link it to nothing? I can. Okay. There we go. Just click on it and it links to nothing. Alright. From Katie Collins to Melanie Rook. Subject, what are Intex thinking? Hey, Melanie. Just a quick question. Sorry if I'm being stupid. You asked me to watch Intex's purchase strategy, and I have. I'm confused. They're buying the same set of materials we were last week in crazy amounts, and I still don't see how they could have... They could ever be used in any legal firearm. I know you can't talk about our own plans, but can you shed any light on theirs? They're getting them slightly cheaper than us, by the way. I know you like to deal with Jackson's company whenever you can, but in this case we paid a high price for it. The only advantage I can see is that the contract says we could return it all for the price paid, but presumably we need all this stuff to go into full-scale production of Project Lusuna, whatever that is. If you want me to shut up and stop asking stupid questions, just say the word. Hmm. I have a feeling that all these things I'm reading are going to play into the bigger story. Maybe there's going to be some plot about weapons, arms, manufacturing, and espionage, and who the hell knows what. Alright, well. 
See if we can hear any secrets. Secrets? No, Intex have that whole call recorded. Yeah, well, thank you, Captain Hindsight. I didn't know they were bugging me. So you've been bugged, huh? Maybe I could get the recording. You can't hear a bug. It's not the fucking 90s. Yeah, alright, I'll let you know. He's not very happy. Alright, well, I guess I'm done. Oh, what is this? Summons the elevator. Can I use it? Nope. My work here is done. I think. Yes. Alright, $308. Sweet. Hey, what happened? Did you hear anything? He says a company called Intex have an incriminating recording of him. Whoa, they're our main rivals, a big multinational company who's opened an office here in East Point. Well, I know why they would be recording Jackson's phone calls. I mean, they're a competitor, so obviously it would be beneficial to know what their competitors are doing. So any idea what Jackson would be saying that he shouldn't? <laughs> oh god, I don't want to think. I don't want to think it, but if he's trying to frame me, maybe he's involved with Selena's death, Selena's death somehow. We'll keep digging. I guess I need to get that recording. Any idea why they'd be why they'd be recording Jackson's phone calls? Well, I already kind of know that. Well, Jackson runs his own company, but it's a dummy company for Rook. Intex will be would definitely want to hear his calls. This is really messed up, but thanks for doing this. I think it's going to be a, a huge help. All right. So, what's my next case? Is it get the recording? Okay. Now I have my pick of uh, choices. Hey, it's Katie again. I think we need to get a hold of Jackson's incriminating recording. Let me know if you're up for it. Thanks. Kind of want to pursue that, because that's the mission I'm already on. Alright, so this is a new one. Industrial espionage. Need a pro for some deniable ops work. Disgusting pay. Uh. Does he mean disgustingly good or, like, disgustingly bad? Because $100 doesn't seem like much. Alright. Increase speed. See what I can buy. I have 305. Uh, land silently from any height. Huh. <laughs> land on your feet instead of your face, which tends to be quieter. Indeed. Or I could save up a little more and get death fluke. Some incoming shots missed. <laughs> I don't want that. I'm, I'd rather just avoid being shot at in the first place. Hush cracker. Muffle breaking glass. Silences the noise when you break a window. I'm going to go for the silent ones and not the combat ones. Ooh. Prank spasm. <laughs> Connect a power socket to another device to electrify it. I like that. I might save up my money. I'm going to save my money for now. Alright, let's do Katie's job. I'd really like to know what's on that recording. I don't want to get Jackson arrested or anything, but the if the recording proves he's framed me, I really need to get out of here. I really need it to get out of here. Agreed. What's the plan? Rook told me that once the Intex... God, I keep misreading everything. Rook told me once that Intex base all their dirty ops... Let me try that again. With the right... Emphasis. Rook told me once that Intex base all of their dirty ops out of their office on Marlowe Street. If you can get in, the recording should be on the main terminal there. Hack a thing? Got it. Conway, thanks. Alright, well this place looks fancy, but... Doesn't appear to have much security. <laughs> it doesn't appear to have much security, and... Are you... Wow. What kind of a security company... Would have a guard in the lobby, facing the opposite direction from the opened lobby door. 
Security Guard of the Year. Good job. You know what that means. He's gonna get punched. Alright, I could go around. Could make it open that, I think. Wait, no, that's on a different circuit. Never mind. Yeah, this is basically the only way it can go. So... Done. <laughs> uh. Alright, well... Oh, I need to hack into this. Let's slam the guard in the face. Switch. Oh, no, no, it needs to be... Oh, right. It needs to be on the same circuit. Okay. In that case, let's go up. Shit, wait, how do I get that open? Hmm. Oh, wait, this is on the... Oh, yeah, this is on the red circuit. Never mind. Okay. So let's do this. Open. Uh. Oh, direction matters. Right. I was having the door opening the switch. The switch should open the door. Short circuit. Ah, because I connected it both ways. I kind of fucked it up. <laughs> yeah, I kind of broke it. Whoops. But thankfully the game seems to recognize I did that, which means it probably didn't crash. And instead actually handles the problem. Okay. Now that this is open, let's... See, I want to slam him in the face. Okay, let me let me unwire this. Now he can't turn on the light, so he's not going to have good vision. I'm going to turn off the light. He's not going to be able to see much. I'm going to open this door. He's going to come through, and then I'm going to hit him in the face. So, do this. Hey, better come in here. Yeah. Investigate, investigate, investigate. That is so awesome. Oh, is this what I need? A, sh a circuit box uh, lets you cross-link things on the circuit? Oh, there's another circuit. Alright, so this can only be activated but What? Why is this one door and the security camera on the same circuit? Okay. Wait, no, that's the wrong way. You need to be like that. Okay. What circuit is this on? This is red. God damn, this game is really fun. It's such a cool sandbox, you know? Really small levels. And you don't have too many abilities. There's not too many things you can do. But still, with the tools you have, there's so many different combinations that you could do. Oh, and is there a laptop here? There is. There's a laptop. <clears throat> From Carl Jensberg, or Jensberg, or something like that, to Fritz Gessler, subject, struggling. Uh, Fritz, look, don't get me wrong, I'm excited about this job and I'm very grateful for this position, but I'm really struggling to see how this company's strategy makes any sense at all. We've muscled into East Point to take over a gun market the same year all handguns are permanently banned for commercial sale. And despite that, we're spending crazy capital to beat Rook out of the market, a market that simply doesn't exist. I know East Point has been a hotspot in the past, and Intex have wanted to open a branch here for a long time, but that was before the ban. East Point was built on guns, mostly by Rook. Why don't we just back out and wait for them to die? Huh. Okay, so there's not really a market for it, so why do they want to beat him out? Are they maybe not selling the guns here? Maybe they're going to sell it to, like, I don't know. Terrorists or something? I am done. Non lethal, medium witnesses, no noise, and once again, thoughtful. Did you find it? Gone, I'm afraid, but the server log showed it was once downloaded by a Rook IP. 
Oh, maybe that was Jackson. If you send me the IP, I might know which office it came from, and maybe we can get it from there. I know which office downloaded the recording of Jackson. If you can get it, you can have everything I have left. Aw. Are you sure you want to go broke? Well, I guess... <laughs> I, it's either go broke or stay in jail, right? So I guess that's a pretty good trade. Alright, well I want to get this guy's like little chump job out of the way. So let's do him next. Let's go for strength. And let's do it. Who the fuck are you? Um... Who the fuck are you? Gessler, CEO, Intex, I need some serious. Uh, wait, I I need someone serious. Are you? Wait a minute. Gessler, wasn't he just mentioned in the email I just read? Yeah, he was. I forgot who he was, though. I mean, I know he's a CEO, but I forgot exactly what his... Was he sending the email or receiving it? Hmm. Optional objective, leave no living witnesses. Hell no. I'm not gonna kill him. Uh, I need someone serious. Are you? I am serious and don't call me Shirley. What? As a pulmonary... Edema? Don't remember how to pronounce that. I think it's edema. Whatever. I make guns. Rook makes guns. Okay, yeah, so he's the CEO of the rival company from to Rook. Uh, Rook's working on some bullshit secret project she thinks is going to let her get around the gun ban, and she doesn't think I know about it. You're gonna steal it. Wait a minute. She thinks it's going to let her get around the gun ban. Is that why they're setting a market here? Because they think they can steal whatever it is she's doing to get around the gun ban, and they're gonna use it for themselves? So they're gonna make a market for themselves, maybe? But, yeah, I don't think I want this job. Because I'm kind of working for Rook. I'm not wild about stealing from Rook. Christ, look, I don't care if you... I don't care if you're fucking her. It's a corporation, this is business. And it's getting done, whoever does it. And unless you're a goddamn employee, I suggest you look at this ridiculous fucking fee again and sign on the, on the figurative fucking line. Where is it? Good point. First, you're gonna find out where it is. She's outsourcing all the work to a company called TX Fabrication to keep it a secret. Head to their admin center on Bellsize Way and search the main terminal. I'll text you the code name you're looking for. Any special requests? Look, I don't judge assets by how well they blither into their f into their fucking phones, so the jury's still out on you. If you want to impress me. Now or any time you're on the Intex op, don't leave witnesses. Anyone does see you, don't leave them breathing. Don't care how many hits it takes. Thanks for the tip, Gandhi. Well, I'm not too hot about working for the rival, but what the hell? I am a freelance spy thief. Bulky guards are enforcers. Enforcers can't be pin pinned down or bashed. Huh. Pinned down or bashed? Does that include being bashed by a door? And what about electrical circuits? Well, there's no door to bash him. And there's... N I don't think there's an electrical circuit to, to stun him, so I guess it doesn't matter. Alright, I think I just have to ignore him. I mean, avoid him. Don't ignore Wait a minute, is this a hatch? <laughs> I can open up that hatch. Is that gonna knock him out, or is it just gonna stagger him? Whoops. Well, let me turn off the light first. And then... Here we go. One, two, three. Ha 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 ha. Ah... This game is very satisfying. Okay. Right, so I need... Need to get to a different circuit. This one. Yep. That's another enforcer. There's a power socket. Which is also red. Good. Good. 
Okay. How do I get him over there? I need him to move to it. Hmm. How do I do this? Well, I don't believe I can go from outside. Oh wait, no, these are windows. I could actually go through the windows. I kind of wish I had that silenced breaking window thing, because then I could go in behind him. Okay, uh, let's see, how am I going to do this? I need to attract him over here. How do I do that? I could break the window, but isn't he just going to shoot me? And he'll be a witness? Huh. Alright, let me try this. That's not going to work, I need to climb. Okay. He saw me. Now how do I get past him? Oh, oh, I can just make it. Just make it. Okay. Whew. Yeah, you saw something. Now just walk on back. Yeah. Yeah. One, two, three, go. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. This game is so freaking cool. Alright, where's the laptop? There it is. From Kelly Ackland to Fritz Gessler. That's the person I just took this job from, right? <laughs> Subject, quit it. For God's sake, Fritz, how many times we are not making anything for Rook? We would. She's great, but she hasn't asked us to. So please stop sending people to steal it. The first guy just got knocked out by a prank spasmed light switch, but the last two we had to kill. Reminder, my company invents shit that hurts people in weird ways. We're a terrible place to rob, especially if we don't even have what you're looking for. Kelly Ackland. <laughs> okay. So apparently, uh, Fritz was... looking in the wrong place. All right, here we go. Now I've got access to the whole place. Let's disable this camera. See, I need down there. Actually, do I want that? No, I think I need that camera. Yeah, hold on. Okay, unhook that. Hook the camera up to that. Wait, does it, does it increase my witness rating if I get seen by the camera? I wonder. How else could I do this? I could hook this switch up to that, but I don't think I'd make it down in time. Wait a minute. How would I, where would I go? I can't get through there. I would need to go up. I could either break out or I could go up. So yeah, I do need I do need the camera to activate. That seems like the only way I can do it. All right, can I uh, have it open? Nope, just one. All right, let's go. <clears throat> okay. And done. Oh, right. Might want to open that. Hundred bucks, medium witnesses, low violence, low noise, and once again, thoughtful. Get it? Got it. The prototypes at a TX fabrication facility on Lyle. 
Fucking A. You'll hear from me when we're ready to move. Ooh, now I have a new job. Conway, get in touch. There's something you should know about our Intex contracts. Hmm. You don't say. Alright, I want to increase the distance. I'm not really too concerned about the charge-up time. Like, that's really not an issue. I'm not getting into combat, so I don't need to do anything super fast, but I could use more speed and more distance, definitely. What does that try it out? Why, is the, why does this one have a button that says try it out? What does that do? Wait, return. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. Try it out. Uh, okay, I guess it's like a demo. The Hushcracker lets you jump through windows quietly. Click in midair to activate it. Oh. I have hair in my mouth. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, uh, cost one battery to use. Okay, so I guess now I have a battery and it has limited uses. Whoa, whoops. Okay, where's my battery? Alright, let's test this out. It still sounded kind of loud, but it worked. It definitely worked. Yeah, I don't see any battery. Hmm. Alright, let's try it again. Click in midair to use. Okay, that is pretty freaking sweet. Wait a minute, there's a... There's an optional objective in this, like, little demo tutorial thing? Hmm. Can see in the dark and shoots even a gunpoint. <laughs> Wait, so professionals can see in the dark? Is... Is that something you can be trained to do? Like, yeah, I trained for years and now I can see in the dark. Okay. Hold on. Let me see if I can angle... Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Boop. Damn it. And... <laughs> that sounded pretty loud, but I'm good. Okay. From Julian Mayfield, East Point PD, to Kelly Ackland, TX Fabrications. Subject, strange requests. Kelly, obviously we're more than happy to provide security for TX Fabrications, but I'm not entirely comfortable with some of your special requests. You're, welcoming, you're welcome to make recommendations about where to assign officers with riot gear, and even specify locations you think an intruder might target. But telling my officers which direction to face is micromanaging to a suspicious degree. Particularly when you're specifying that they should look away from a fragile window and potential entry point. What exactly is it that you don't want them to see? Okay, so I'm not the only one that found that suspicious, huh? 